was an accident. You're an asshole. You can't do anything you want. fitness friday vlog if you're new here my name is kiera don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel okay so today is tuesday i am starting to vlog a day late because yesterday i didn't feel like vlogging so here we are today so like i was telling y'all in the last vlog i said that my main problem with my weight loss journey is my eating habits because as I said before, if Kiera wants to eat, Kiera gon' eat, okay? And that's not, that's not how it works when you're trying to lose weight. So there's this girl I follow on Instagram. I think her name is like Lovely Leash. I don't know. I don't know her name. But she does like little workouts and food plans and stuff like that. So she has this thing called carb cycling and I bought that plan from her. It was like a food guide for $20. So it, that's what we're gonna do for the next 30 days is carb cycling. So let me read to you what she says about carb cycling. She says, what is carb cycling? It's a dietary approach in which you alternate carb intake. It is commonly used to lose fat, maintain physical performance while dieting. A great method to use when wanting to drop some unwanted fat but keep curves, which is everything I'm trying to do. So, um, today I started it. Um, I went to, hold on, backtrack. <clears throat> So today I officially started the carb cycle thing. Um, so today was a low carb day. So she wants you to eat five meals a day, like small five meals. I've only had two. It's kind of a lot when, you, when you're not at home. I don't know. I'm gonna figure it out. But this morning I had two scrambled eggs with two pieces of turkey bacon and then as my morning snack i had one of those chobani yogurts now i'm i was supposed to have lunch by now and probably my afternoon snack but i i haven't um so yeah but i did go to the grocery store to pick up some foods for this carb cycling so let's look and see what i got so essentially you have high carb days low carb days and no carb days so on those each days like she gives an example list of what you can eat for those days i took that as a literal manual because i don't know what i'm doing sis this is your program so i bought everything on the grocery list she provided so let's go with some of the things that I got. As I said before, you're supposed to eat five meals a day. I definitely did not do that. Um, so she does recommend taking protein shakes as meal replacements just to make it easier. I don't like protein shakes. So I didn't know which protein shakes I should get. So I bought four different kinds. The first one I got is by the brand Naked. It's a vanilla protein. There it is. Next I got from the brand Boathouse. It's a Dutch chocolate banana. This looks really good. Focus. Focus. There it goes. Next, I got one from Rebel. This is also a vanilla protein. This is a plant-powered elixir. Mm. Now, why would you focus on my laptop when this big bottle is in front of you? There it is. 
And then this last one, I was just passing by this and I saw this, but Maya Fam on YouTube, I follow her on Instagram also, and she had this in her fridge, so influencer marketing at its finest, I picked it up. It's the Fit Shake Protein, and it's also in vanilla. And also what made me want to pick this up is the packaging. The packaging is so cute. Look at that. It's so cute. So these are all of the protein shakes that I bought. Like I said, I was supposed to have had lunch by now. Um, so I'm gonna drink one of these protein shakes while I'm talking to y'all and we're gonna try the cutest one, the Fit Shake. So let's see how this one tastes. All right, here we go. Just kidding, there's a... <laughs> Ma'am, please, I'm, I'm trying to make money for us. Please be quiet. Okay, so here is the Fit Shake Vanilla Protein Shake. Mmm, it tastes just like a protein shake. Nasty. Um, it's 140 calories, 20 grams of protein. It's gluten-free and lactose-free. Yeah, this is, uh, it tastes like a protein shake. Anyway, moving on, cause that's kinda nasty. On her um, grocery list as a snack, it says uh, low fat yogurt so i got the chobani greek yogurt i got it in strawberry and in black cherry some garlic because you always need some minced garlic you just throw this up in there like salt and pepper this goes in everything some bananas because this is a great thing to quickly pick up and eat baby carrots avocados baby red potatoes then i got these sweet cherries these things are so good this lady that i used to work with this older black lady miss pauline hey miss pauline i love you i miss you um i stayed eating her candy and her food so one day she brought in these black cherries and i was like i don't even like cherries miss pauline i don't want those and she was like just try it just try it and I ate about half of her container. I told you not to let me eat it. But I got, I got two of these because I literally just, oh, I just dropped the cherry. But I got two of those because I literally just sit down and just keep eating those. Cause they're so good. I also got these Thai basil vegetable dumplings. Just something new to try. Something new. This is what they look like. Of course I got some eggs because you always need eggs. Some ground turkey. Chicken wings, the party wings, they're my favorite. A bunch of tuna cans. Some black beans. I got some broccoli. Some zucchini. I love zucchini, zucchini's my favorite. Some spinach some tomatoes, and some asparagus. Okay, so that was all the stuff she told me to get. Now, this is the stuff that I picked up because I just wanted it. We got the Panera Bread at home broccoli and cheddar soup. I've heard lots of good things, lots of good things. I've heard a lot of good things about this soup that tastes really good. And it says one serving size is a cup and that's 240 calories. And I really just thought like this would have been a great quick meal. But I would probably only eat this on my heart high carb days. Something I wasn't supposed to get. Also, I got these Morning Star Buffalo Chicken Patties. These are veggie. Now it did say that I can get like veggie meat. So like she kind of said I can get this, but she didn't say specific, specifically this. 
Blah. I got it and it's here. And I got some marinades for my party packs. Next, I got these apple pie nut and date bars. It's just six ingredients, dates, almonds, apples, walnuts, raisins, and cinnamon. This was such an impulse buy. Like this wasn't even in the right section it was supposed to be, but I saw apple pie. I said, mm, what's that? So I picked it up. So one bar is 180 calories. And it says there's 26 grams of carbs in this. So that's a lot. High carb days. See, this one not my fault because she said that I needed Ezekiel bread, right? So I was in the bread aisle for the longest time looking for some dang Ezekiel bread. And I couldn't find us. So I said, you know what? I'm just about to pick up some bread. And this is the bread I picked up. So this is the bread that's gonna get ate. I also bought me some coffee and some creamer. Once again, like I've been saying, on my high carb days. So yeah, those are all my groceries. I'm gonna go put my groceries up right now. Um, and then after that, I will be doing my trainer's workout to drink this protein shake. So I'm gonna drink this right now and then I'll just see y'all later. I'll see y'all when I see y'all. How about that? So the groceries are all put up. I'm about to make my pre-workout so that I can work out. <clears throat> so in home girls notes, she said it's best to do like leg days and stuff like that on high carb days. So that's what I'm gonna start doing on high carb days. I'm gonna do legs, like lower body, and then on low carb and no carb days, we're gonna do like arms, cardio, stuff like that. Today is a low carb day. I'm gonna do Dre's workout, my Zoom trainer's workouts, and then I'm gonna go to the gym, and then we're gonna do arms and back today at the gym. And of course, I'm going to do the bike and the treadmill before that. Should I bring y'all with me to the gym? I feel like I should bring y'all. I'm going to bring y'all. So, after I finish Dre's workout, because y'all not going to watch me do that today. <laughs> after I finish Dre's workout, I'm going to come back. And then we're gonna go to the gym. So I'll see y'all then. All right, y'all, I finished Dre's workout. I burned 457 calories and it was an hour long. I'm so tired. But now before I talk myself out of it, we're gonna go to the gym. And to be honest, I'm actually not gonna bring y'all with me because I'm tired. <laughs> And that's just that on that. I don't feel like moving a camera around and whatnot. So I'm going to go to the gym and then we're going to come back. And I still have to cook dinner and that's so ugly, but I'm hungry. All right, y'all. Here's my food. I made me some rice with some zucchini and then some baked chicken wings. I'm extremely hungry, so... I'm about to eat and I'll see y'all tomorrow.
it's July 21st. It is 8.04 in the morning. Today I don't have to go into work until 11 o'clock. So that's why I'm still home. Right now we're gonna take our apple cider vinegar shot. I'm so excited. Because our homegirl in our carb cycling um, program, she says it's best to take the apple cider, apple cider vinegar shot in the morning before you have your breakfast. Whereas before I was taking it in the middle of the day. So we're gonna go ahead and have it before our breakfast. Cheers. Oh. I need a minute. I'll be right back. That was nasty. Um, so now I'm about to do one of my Vision Body Fit workouts, the pre recorded ones. And then. I'm gonna make breakfast and yeah, get ready for the day. So let's go do it. to do 30 but girl I got time so I did 25 minutes and I burned 210 calories you know a cute little a cute little morning workout let's get a look at the body body the body 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 okay because we've been what making progress out here in these streets so right now I'm about to make me some breakfast and then i'm gonna get in the shower and then get ready for my day so i'll probably see y'all later for real no i'm gonna show y'all my breakfast and then i'll see y'all later okay so today is another low carb day so i'm having three three scrambled eggs some turkey bacon and some of my cherries I put them in these plastic cups in my fridge so it could be like just quick, easy grab and like portion control kind of. And then I'm going to just drink some water. But yeah, y'all, that's what I'm going to eat. I'll see y'all later. Oh, Hi. <laughs> Hi, guys. Oh, Get cute. Ooh, 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 ooh. Not the titty bounce. Ooh, wow. You better run it. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> it's so cute in here. Oh, she's. Do you have a card I think so. This is my spending money card. I'm good. Just go look at the card box. 
I always do that in her videos. <laughs> Nowhere to put my camera. It's gonna be dark in there anyway. Mm -hmm. Mike, was it a good? Was it a good? It was a good class. Yeah, was it? It was a good class. You get your sweat. You get a shoulder bounce with it. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. okay. Bitch. <laughs> no. I'm gonna grab my belongings so I don't leave them because I'm good for that. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So I'm back home from Edge Cycle for dinner. I made some salmon and a little shallot. Um Edge Cycle was so much fun. Like I really enjoyed it. I'm gonna keep going. The the instructor fine as fuck what the hell what the hell that nigga fine okay oh also so my home girl the one who um <laughs> who's doing the carb cycling thing she said i had to drink a protein shake after i work out every time so today's protein shake <clears throat> was this boathouse protein plus this shit nasty this I wanted to fight myself for picking this up. This is nasty, y'all. But you know, I'm gonna drink it. It's nasty, though. I will not be repurchasing this one. Mm -mm. Mm -mm, I will not. But yeah, I think this is gonna be the end of the vlog because I don't think I'm gonna film tomorrow, but if you made it this far thank you so much for watching my vlog oh wait also i'm very proud of myself because i have not cheated on this carb cycle diet not once i know it's been like two days but that's besides the point i would have normally cheated by now i almost cheated tonight when bria was driving me home i was like let's go get a frosty from wendy's and i was like no please just take me home hurry up drop me off so but like I was saying, thank you for watching my video if you made it this far. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I will see y'all in the next one. Okay, y'all, so today is a Thursday. It's finally a high carb day. I can have some bread. So this morning, it's actually like, it's not morning time no more. It's 11.09, it's almost noon. But I didn't get up this morning to make my breakfast. So right now, I made me like a little breakfast sandwich. We got some egg and some turkey bacon. Also, I'm about to put this this salsa. You ever had the Mexican style salsa, the mild one from McDonald's? Bussin. But I'm about to eat my breakfast. And then when I come back, we got some working out to do.
gym. It was a good workout. My camera's dying. But I'm about to close this vlog out, but I gotta try my new protein. Today we're gonna do this one. Hold on, I'll be right back. Yeah.